Good morning, I'm Burroughs Smith. I'm the uh, managing part of the development team of River Bluffs. And this is our last phase, just 91 lots. And we're just showing progress reports as we go along. And um, so we've finished about, a, we're just mopping up our clearing operation and we're waiting on manholes so they can start on the sewer. I've got surveyor staking out manhole locations, see if I want to tweak their locations a little bit to get away from trees and, um, and make things more workable. And so we're starting on uh, phase four here. We're getting a road in on the um, first eight lots. This was um, actually designed and cleared back years ago when we did phase one and um, we just never built it. And so um, what we're doing now is putting in the first eight lots. And these, um, these houses will be very similar to what's already on Barnes, Barnesmore and around Quince Commons. So what we're doing is um, I'm staking out our, where the future sewer manholes will be going. And it just gives me a way to look at things and um, it's gonna be real important back on uh, Old Forest Road where we have the big center island and how we're dodging trees there. What we do is we, they, they like to dig their power lines back here. I've worked out a deal with them where we'll actually dig in front of the stake for them so they can lay the power lines out here. So we're saving a 10 foot ribbon all the way around. So, you know, that amounts to acres of trees. So these lots are gonna be spectacular. They back up to, um, you know, the natural areas. They're gonna be our biggest lots. Um, future lots, so these will be, you know, really great lots in here. So I'm on lot 552. You can see it's heavily wooded. This is on Limelight Court. And um, the depth of this lot is fantastic and it backs up to some natural areas. Um, so this is going to be a great home site for somebody in the future. Um, this is lot 550 and this backs up to the northern boundary of our community. A lot of wildlife, wildlife comes through here. If I lived in that house, it's gonna be here on 550, I'd have me a little fire pit or something back here, or a bench, and this would be where I'd spend the evenings. Um, this is kind of like the hidden jewel of the community. I feel like it's very peaceful. There's some running water, there's a little dam, natural dam where a log fell over. You can hear the water rustling. And you can see that Limelight doesn't have all the pretty lots. This is a beautiful lot. Backs up to a wooded area that's, uh, again, you're on the northern edge of our community. There will be a, a, um, a nature trail back right along the boundary line. And that'll be actually full-blown nature. It will not be upgraded with any kind of stone or pavement. It'll just be dirt and grass. And then this will be the high point of the road so we don't have to cut much of this road, meaning that we don't cut dirt and a lot of tree roots. And then uh, it gives these trees a much better chance of survival. And we'll be trying to stay as far off of them as we can. Um, it's just tough, you know, when you build a road saving trees, but we work at, hard at it and we've had a pretty good success rate throughout the community. And we hope to continue this now. And this gives such a nice break between the lots on this side and then the ones back over here.